Good morning, everybody. It's Kim with Fitness of Fido, and I have Princess Leia joining me today. Today will be more of a slow flow class. We're going to be focusing on us on the shoulders, upper back, and neck area, kind of release some tension because a lot of times we pull our shoulders and head forward too much. So we're just going to try and stretch those out. And the only equipment you're going to need today is some dog treats. We're just going to use the dogs and have them walk around our bodies and stuff. If you guys don't know Leia, she's very uh, laid back. She doesn't know, or she, not that she doesn't know, she doesn't like doing much uh, of working out. So maybe you guys can relate. I don't know about your dogs, but I'm sure there's some people out here that are like, I understand. So we're just going to get started. Just sitting on the ground, nice and tall. If your dog is in front of you, you can kind of give them some pets. As we begin to focus on our breath. Inhaling in and exhaling out. Inhale through your nose and out your mouth. That a couple more times. Okay, and then from here, what we're going to start with, let me see if I can get her to do something before she lays down the whole time, is I want them to just walk around your body. So let me see if I can get her up. Leia! Come on, Leia! Yes, let's do a little bit of work. Come on, upsy-daisy! I know. So just like this, try and go in each direction. Where'd you go? <laughs> Leia! Come on! You know what to do. Come on, Leia! Good girl, almost! So you guys keep doing it in each direction while we're trying to make one complete circle. Leia! <laughs> you good girl. Yes. Oh, she doesn't even like the treats I have. <laughs> Do I need to get you some more treats? Uh -huh. Let's see if she'll go the other way. <laughs> All right, Leia. All right, let's bring them back to the center. I'm going to grab uh, some other treats and see if maybe she likes those better. Are you a silly girl? All right, from here, let's just do some neck rolls with them. So place them in a sit. 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 Good girl. And then we're just going to have them look left and right in that seated position. All right, these treats a little better. Here you go. Good girl. <laughs> oh, hairball? Okay. You can have them look down, bring that nose uh, with the treat right into their chest, and look up. Come on, Nia. Oh, I love you. Good girl. Okay, Leia requested paw next. So if they know paw, hold on Leia, don't sit yet. <laughs> if they know paw, then just have them give you paw, try and do it on each side, and just hold it maybe five seconds a piece, let them get a little bit of a stretch. She already laid down. You're too cute and lazy. <laughs> okay, and then from here, let's place them in a down. And then we're gonna do those same neck stretches, looking to the left and to the right. Good girl. And you can try and get them deeper into a stretch while laying down. They might look, see if she'll do it. There you go, so you can see she's kind of having to rock her hips to the left and the right, moving her paws a little bit to follow the treat. There we go, so that's giving a little bit of a spinal stretch, so let's try that again. There we go. Good girl, yes, good girl. 
and on this side. So you can see she's really rocking side to side. That was very good. Good girl. Okay, we'll do one more move with them and then we'll kind of transfer back to us. And this is a nice kind of quicker workout today. It's more slow flow, but when I say quick and that it's only like 20 minutes. Um, but what we're going to do is bring them back in two while well, they should still be in their down. And then what I want you to do is try and line them up. And then from here, once you get them more centered, I want you to just kind of rock them forward. Good girl. And then kind of rock them back. So you don't want to pull it too far forward because then they'll start crawling. So you can see it just a little bit. There you go. Oh, yes, that was a little too much. And grab another treat. All right, here it is. So you're kind of pushing them back and forward. There. So this is a nice hip opener for them. It works on their core. It's stretching out all in this area. Now, if your dog is not doing this, it does take time just to work on laying down and just slightly just moving their head forward and back. Give me a couple more. There you go, good girl. You're so good. Yes. <laughs> good girl. All right. Okay. And then we'll kind of transition into us. So. so again, if you want to center up in front of your dogs, you can. We'll be mainly in this seated position for the rest of the time. And all I want you to do is sit up nice and tall. You can keep your hands on your dogs to pet them. Yes, so they always know you're there. Yes. And let's inhale in and out. The dogs will pick up on your energy. I'm picking up on Leia's energy. She's very relaxed. And then from here on your next breath, I want you to bring your hands to your shoulders just like this. And then what we're going to do is pull those elbows in together. Do your best, pull them in. And then we're going to inhale and raise them up, separating them, elbows pointing to the ceiling. And then we're gonna do that again. We're making like a circle. So it's like you have chicken wings, you're back here. Pull those elbows in and pull them up. Do that once more. Take your time with these. Try and go nice and slow, really focusing on the movement. When you're pulling them in, you're pulling those shoulders in. You're looking up. You're separating and really trying to squeeze those shoulder blades together. One more time. and back to the center. And then from here, keep those elbows close together and then you're going to open up your hands like this. So palms are facing, maybe you can flex them and give your dog a little pet if they're still in front of you. Good girl. And then all I want you to do is bring those wrists in and out. Give me one more and release. Bring those hands behind you now. I'll turn this way so you can see me and so I can pet Leia, but you're just going to bring them behind you. If you can, just pet your dog. Sit up nice and tall. And if your dog's not around you, just bring your hands all the way to the ground.
and release. Very good. Bring it back to the center. Good girl, yes. I love you. Okay. And then bring those hands up back in your chicken wing position. If you can, interlace your fingers like this behind your head. Find a comfy spot. And then all we're going to do now is pull those elbows in like this. And you're going to pull it forward, rounding your back, bringing your chin to your chest. Hold it there for maybe about five seconds. And then we're going to open up, look up towards the ceiling, opening up the chest, letting those elbows drop to the side. And then we're going to repeat that movement for roughly maybe four to six more times, pulling it in. And opening back up. Really focus on your elbows. When you open up, you're pushing them out. And then when you're coming in, pull them in. Give me maybe one more. Pull that belly button in. And open up. And release those hands off to the sides. Don't touch the ground yet. You just look like this. Pull those fingertips up into your shoulders. Relax the shoulders. You probably should feel a nice little stretch in your forearms. You're keeping them out. You know, they're not down here right now. They're not parallel. They're just right around in this area. Breathe, inhale in and out. And then we're going to take that right hand over your head slightly Push down just gently, pull that head towards your right shoulder. Should feel that in that neck all the way down your left arm, keeping those fingers flexed. You want to play around with it, bring that arm up just a tad. And slowly release the right hand. We're going to take that left hand to your head. Again, nice and gently. Just press down, lengthening the neck, keeping those fingers flexed. If you want, raise that right arm a little bit for a little deeper stretch. Keeping those fingers separated in that high five position. And slowly release. Very good. And do a couple shoulder rolls. There you go. Yeah. Quick pet for the dogs. Good girl. Yes. I love Leia. This is all Leia wants is just getting petted. Yes. So that's why today is just all about bonding today. This is more of just a relaxing day, perfect if it's a rainy day or something, or just a chill day, maybe before bed. But let's bring it back up, sit up nice and tall, and then let's just do some neck rolls. Roll your head side to side. Keep those shoulders relaxed. Nice. One more neck roll. Bring it back to the center. And roll it up nice and slow. Okay, from here, if your dog is on your side like this, I want to try and move. Uh, now, ideally, 
It'd be nice to keep it even, but a lot of times your dog won't get up and then go lay on their other side, so you might have to do this at a separate time. But if your dog is laying on the side, I'm going to show you the next move. Otherwise, just kind of massage them. So what I want you to do is place one hand on their belly. Actually, place the hand that's closer to their head. So for me, it's my right hand. And you're just going to pet them and then take your other hand with a treat. Come here. See the cookie? Come here. Can you work? Leia. Leia. <laughs> oh my goodness. Leia. See the cookie? You want the cookie? Okay. Well, she's doing it slightly, but I want you to try and get their head up a little higher. That's better. There you go. Good girl. Yes. And then bring it down. Good girl. So that was a little bit of a lazy one. Uh, we'll try it one more time. <laughs> Leia's got such a hard life. <laughs> yes, I know. It's hard waking up early. There you go, here she is. So I'm just keeping that hand there, petting her, letting her get that treat, and bring it back down. Good girl. Let's try one more. Just pull it up. There you go. I know that's a little challenging, isn't it? Very good. Okay. So we'll see, maybe she'll move to her other side. I doubt she will. And I doubt your dogs will either. So again, if you see them, take note of what side they're on and then you can try the other side. But from here, let's just move on to all fours. We're gonna do a couple cat and cows. Yes, Lydia. And then bring it back to a neutral position. And then we're going to take that right arm up over your head. Reach up towards the ceiling. I love you, Leia. And then we're going to thread the needle. Bring it under that left arm. And then sit back in the child's pose looking over at the right fingertips. And inhale back up onto all fours. Remember, pet your dog as much as possible. Include them as much as possible. All right, we're gonna do the left side. Inhale that left arm up, look up towards the ceiling. Hold it here. And then exhale, pull that arm under. Sit back into your child's pose. Inhale back up onto all fours. From here, we'll have a seat next to the dogs again. She actually rolled onto her other side. So I might actually be able to do these. Good girl. Yes, we'll make it even. Hopefully, your dog did like her, but if they didn't, just massage them. Or just you can do some of those plank saws we did if they're laying down or neck rolls. There's one. So she did three, so I'm going to keep it even, do a couple more. And then we'll just kind of finish up with today's doga session. Good girl. Yes. Good girl. Yes. Good girl. So if they are doing that move, you're trying to get them to reach up without sitting up. 
And then you're trying to bring them back down as well. So it's all one move. They're kind of curling up. Getting a little stretch of the spine while working the core. The last one. And lay down. Yes, good girl. Yes, good girl. Alright. Good girl. Alright, so we made it even on each side. So from here, we'll bring it back to us before we end for today. It's just sitting up nice and tall. And then what I want you to do is just do some neck up and down. So you're going to bring your chin to your chest. Inhale, look up towards the ceiling. Keep those shoulders relaxed the whole time. Looking up and down. Do that about six more times. Still sitting up nice and tall, matching your breath. Yes. Inhale as you look up. Exhale back down for two more. And back to the center. And what I want to do here is just engage that core, pull that belly button in, hold everything nice and tight. And then we're just going to twist, bring that left arm behind you. Slight rotation back. Maybe you can take your right hand back with you for a deeper stretch. You're so cute, Leia. And go to the other side. Just walk those hands to the side. And back to the center. And then what we'll do from here is bring that left hand down to the side or behind your back if possible. Let me show you. So something like this. And then I want you to take that right hand, press down on that trap muscle. That's that muscle right in between your neck and like your shoulder. And just press down, bring your head to the right side. Just holding pressure on that muscle. Bring your head to the left and to the right and left. One more time to the right and to the left. Let's finish up on the other side. Right hands just to the side. Maybe you'll uh, bend your elbow where your fingertips are behind your back. And then place your left hand on that trap muscle right in here. Press down with whatever pressure, whether you want light or medium. And then look away from it. Hold on, Leah. I'm coming back to you. And then to the right, keep those shoulders relaxed. Look away. One more, bring it down and then bring it back up. And slowly release. Bring it back to the center. Kind of shake those shoulders out. Maybe do some shrugs, pull those uh, shoulders up towards your ears. Relax, do that a couple times. Up and down. And then from here, let's just finish up with massaging the dogs. Yes, Leia had such a, you know, strenuous workout today. <laughs> 
So all we're doing is just kind of massaging their neck area or wherever really. She's wanted a massage the entire time. <laughs> she says, I have to work to get a massage? What? <laughs> I love you, Leia. <laughs> so if you guys have any dogs that relate to Leia's uh, energy levels, yeah, let me know. Because, <laughs> uh, yeah, typically they're like, you know, all in your face, want to lick you, sit on you. Not Leia. Mm-mm. <laughs> Mm-mm. So yeah, today's class was definitely more for the older dogs or more the laid back dogs that just, you know, kind of want to chill and hang out with you and get petted. But I want to thank you for joining me today. Hopefully this helped, you know, release any tension in that upper body shoulder area. Maybe they feel a little looser. So anyways, that's all for today. Um, uh, thanks for joining me. Yes, and Miss Leia, thanks for joining me and Leia. And then, I think that's about it that I know of, that I can think of. If you guys can think of anything, let me know. And I will talk to you soon. Now I'm gonna stay home with my dog. Yes. <laughs> You're just the sweetest thing, Leia. Mm-hmm.